Hey guys, we're back, and I kind of owe you guys an apology, because last time, uh, as you may remember, we were about to face off against a monster, monster zoo. And I had the video all recorded and everything, and I processed it, and afterwards it kept, there was like minutes at a time where the video was just black. And for the life of me, I can't really uh, understand why I did that. Uh, as you may remember, I'm just getting into this software and it's kind of black magic, so. Um, I'll probably upload the video as an outtake or something, but I kind of had to rewind a bit. And I was, I've noticed when you crash Dreadmore um, forcibly and come back, usually it'll have everything in the same spot. But apparently when you load a new floor, it randomly generates it. So, since I didn't have a save from floor 2, we were kind of wrecked, as it were. So, uh, yeah, a little bit of revisionist history. So, uh, sorry about that, um, but beyond that, um, everything is the same. Still using the, um, mods we had last time. Uh, still using the same skill tree. We're still Freddy, no worries. And, uh, I think we did lose a level somewhere in there, though. Might have had, uh, highly aware. But, uh, yeah, that's really all the, uh, big stuff I need to talk about, so let's play Dreadmore. And get this delicious, delicious copper. Alright, uh, really I'm just uh, hoping we don't crash into another monster zoo like that. That was... Hello, what are you? A power gauntlet. Two plastic, a voltic cell, and a copper wire. I think we might have that back at the forge. Well, I'll have to go check that out at some point. There's a helm of three pulled, we don't need that. I think powdered aluminum is a potion thing, but I'm not sure, so we'll grab it. Oh god, mummies and whites. This is just like an episode of Scooby Doo. Uh, something tells me I better get out of that. <laughs> oh yeah, ghosts hover over traps. That's so dumb. Although I do want this arrow trap. Pears are terrible. Let's eat some pears. Well, regeneration-wise, they're pretty good. Wow, lots of criticals going off here. It's kind of unnerving. Please cast Animal Friend on me. What does that mean? Oh, jeez. Zombie, I hate you. Just so you know. We do have a plum. Excellent. There we go. And like last time, we're going to be taking highly aware. And I think that gets us uh, mostly caught up. So yeah, I will be, um, like I said, uploading the uh, the last video as an outtake or something. Um, but. Uh, no worries, Freddy didn't die, so this is not reviving him from a death. We're, uh, we're totally legit here. It's just, uh... 
I really wish I knew why it did that. These stupid, uh... Dreadmore videos only record, like, two minutes at a time. So they're gigantic. Maybe I'm recording too high or something? I don't know. Otherwise, I would just go back and reprocess it. If the whole thing wasn't, like... 30 gigabytes for 20 minutes. I don't like floor two. Ten? Oh yeah, wait a minute. I think we had also last time... ...decided to make some real armor for the time being. So I guess let's uh, go catch up on that quickly, since we're right near the forge. Come on, Magic Potato, I'll kill you. Since we're uh, right near our forge here... Oops. Look at me being a stupid. Okay, let's see here. Oh yeah, I believe last time we also sorted these out. Also, for some reason we discovered you can stack lots of traps on the same square. So we're just, uh... These traps are kind of clogging up the inventory and I don't find myself using them much. Just, uh... Remind me not to step on that square, please. Okay, this is the square for silly crafty bits. This is the square for gemstones. We're gonna get some rhyme and reason going on here. Amber, diamonds... Powders go here. I don't actually need an ingot press. This is for stuff we might want to enchant. Where did that mana potion go? Oh, there he is. Potions go here. We'll keep the invisibility and the purity. We don't need the infernal potion. Alright, powdered aluminum. Actually, do we have... we have chalk. We want chalk. So let's get uh, smelting here. We'll make some copper. Some plastic. Lots of uh, iron. Hold off on converting that to bronze because I think copper's slightly more useful to us. Make an omelet. And now for the fun part, what can we tink? Now if we had a voltic cell and a copper wire, we could make a mysterious power glove. Oh no, that's a rank six. Good lord. That means we need, like, items or something. Or that, uh, silly Clockwork Knight skill tree. Now, I know there's a, um... You can make a goggles that gives you plus one to your, um... Tink tree, but for the life of me, we don't have them. 
The recipe, I mean. I know it's a leather hat, two diamonds, and, uh, something else. Oh, if we had, uh, zinc, we could make a, uh, battery. I tell you what I really want is that overclocked clockwork power limb. That clockwork chain axe looks amazing. Okay, well I'm not seeing anything particularly um, interesting we can get out of that, so we'll make a square for our ores. Steel Ingot is a testament to the fact that you'd really rather be playing some other video game with a more finely honed crafting system. Oh well. <laughs> we'll put mushrooms here, because I know they're occasionally used in crafting. And uh, away we go. Since apparently we can't make any... Um, I thought we'd made some armor. Or maybe we found some. I don't know. Someone please help me remember not to step on that square in the forge, because otherwise this is going to be a really, really quick trip down into the dungeon. Hey, Brax! Arguably just what we need. Thick leather work gloves. Thick, sturdy gloves. You could just rub bricks all day, if you're into that. Is that a Mario RPG reference? I think it is. this helmet a go, see how, um... Okay, so that reduces our dodge by one and increases our block by three, so that's not bad. Let's sell that hat. Well, I kind of want to buy that, uh, Queerus as well. I'm sure we'll find one. Just want to get a little dodge and armor reduction going on here because uh, we're a little squishy still, as y'all may have noticed. Oh lord. Dodge. Ooh, Fairy Watcher. That's just what I needed one. This sword is made of roughly finished iron, mediocre at best. C plus. <laughs> Dreadmore. Oh, oh lord, we're not playing with three on, uh, three attacks around. There we go, that's a bit better. Yay, awful! Matter of fact, let's munch on some awful. There we 
There we go, now we're feeling a bit better. Oh, rusty metal buckler. I get the feeling we might want... Hello, unfriendly AI. Is there any chance we can... Oh, you don't suffer knockback? Well, either way, this seems to be working. There we go. Let's have some cheese. Oh good, we did that all for a hefty stick. No thank you. You sure do dress funny. Okay, Dad. Got a steak. Got a broken barrel. Oh, it's a stupid zombie. Stupid zombies and they're having all of the HP. There. Okay, do we have anything interesting in this room? No. Oops. Good job, eyebrow guy. We have successfully poisoned ourselves. Hey, bronze, and yay, another omelette. up there we didn't explore. Let's go check that out. Wandering Monster Table. Here's where monsters play poker or dice between rounds of aimlessly wandering the dungeons. Alright. I'll buy it. <laughs> wandering Monster Table. That's pretty good. Hey, Blobby! Wow, we kicked him all the way across the room. <laughs> I need an adult. <laughs> yes! Now the spatial instability fusion. Those are really good. Yay, money! And a little black book. Ooh, and emeralds. Emeralds are good. Well, if you have smithing, you can forge them into a silly uh, emerald encrusted ring that gives loads of health regen. Oh, nothing in there. Well, we've uh, uncovered a fair section of floor two. So let's, uh, poke our head in at Brax, sell him a little book. And I think we are going to call it here for today. So, thank you everyone for bearing with me on uh, the slight technical difficulties here. I'm going to try and make sure it won't happen again, but I'm not quite sure what caused it, so... I guess uh, that's all down to luck. And, uh, yeah. Until next time. <laughs>